Local homeowner is outraged tonight because she paid for a job that was not even started. News 4 Tucson investigator Matthew Schwartz has uncovered details about the contractor's history. I'm extremely upset every day that I walk into my home and I can't use my kitchen and it, it, it's it's very upsetting. This is what Mariah Peru's kitchen has looked like for almost two months. That's how long ago she expected granite countertops to be installed. She says she paid $1,950 to Christopher Romo to install them in the east side home she moved into six months ago. Only a sample of the granite is here. The entire order, Mariah later found out, was ready for pickup at a local store, but not paid for. I want my money back. I worked very hard to get that money. What kind of financial hardship has this created on you? Um, so I basically, Matthew, that was, that was all I had. Did you ever check to see if Romo had a license? I did not. This isn't the first complaint about Christopher Romo's work. Far from it. According to the Arizona Registrar of Contractors, and the agency says that Romo is not licensed. A spokesman says Romo has never been licensed by the Registrar of Contractors to perform the contracting work he's been hired to do. The spokesman says the agency has investigated seven complaints against Romo since 2010, from homeowners from Tucson up to Paradise Valley. The spokesman says investigations have found that Romo took more than $22,000 from these homeowners and in exchange quote, provided poor work or abandoned the jobs completely. The agency issued $6,500 in civil penalties against Romo and submitted five cases to prosecutors. Those cases resulted in almost $12,000 in restitution and nearly $4,300 in fines. Mr. Romo, this is Matthew Schwartz from the News 4 Tucson Investigators. I left Romo didn't return our call or respond after we went to his home and left our card in the door requesting that he call us. What kind of work did he do as far as quality? Horrible. Laura Egan is the office manager at TAB Tile and Stone. Romo worked for TAB for three weeks recently as an independent contractor. Every single job that he did for us, we had to send another crew back to either repair it or replace the work that he's done. The company is not using Romo anymore and is this giving is Mariah White. Peru her so granite countertops for $2,500. The and regular these, these price for the job would be $5,300. Meanwhile, Mariah received texts from Romo last Friday night, apparently after he found out we were reporting this story. He apologizes to her and says he has half her money and asks for two weeks to get her the rest. That was the last she heard from him. If you could talk to Christopher Romo now, what would you say? He can't be doing this. He, he knew what I was going through and I told him that I was, I was struggling to get the money. It really has been a nightmare. Arizona contractors need a license for any job of $1,000 or more. Mariah hired Romo from a friend of a friend and says she's learned from this ordeal to research the contractor, speak with former customers, and go to the Registrar of Contractors website to check that he or she is indeed licensed. We've put the link to the ROC on our website. And if you have a story you'd like us to investigate, email us at investigators at kvoa.com or call 955-4444. Investigating for you, Matthew Schwartz, News 4 Tucson.